Hi all, today I will show you how you can actually translate your online store to different languages. So we have a new app which is from Shopify itself called Translate and Adapt. So we are going to see how you can actually uh, translate your store using the app provided by Shopify itself. There were a lot of apps that were available for translation which were from third party providers and you have to pay for those apps. But now we have a free app from the Shopify team itself called Translate and Adapt app. So this app called translate and adapt app from shopify gives us a free two languages translation automatically so this is a list of the uh, languages that are available for tree free translation from shopify so you can go through this uh, list and uh, if your language that you wanted to translate is one among these then you can actually get those two languages which shopify is giving us for free for automatic translation so I am actually uh, in uh, UAE, uh, so most of my customers need an Arabic translation for their websites. So but Arabic is not there in the automatic translation list from Shopify. But there are few other languages. If one of your uh, targeted language comes under any of these, you can make use of the automatic translations that Shopify gives us uh, using this free app. Now let us see how to install this app. So you can so you can click on search for translate and adapt in uh, app store so this is the app okay so you can see that this is from shopify itself not from any other third party providers let us click on that and install the app so this is a free app okay so i'm installing the app now So now I have set up my uh, language English, uh, English as the default language. So I need to actually add new languages. So let us click on manage and you can see a button called add a language over here. Click on add a language and you can select which languages you want to add. So first let me add a language which is already there in this list. Okay, let me add Hindi. So I'm adding Hindi and I'm clicking on uh, next and which markets we want to show you ha you can click on that we already have a video about Shopify markets uh, if you are not aware of the uh, markets feature in Shopify please go to that uh, please check out that video click on done so Hindi is actually now added as a language now what you have to do you have to click on publish so I've just published the language now. Now let us go to the translate and adapt app. And you can see that uh, you can actually choose the different languages that you have added over there. So one language that is uh, English, which is my default language. The other language that I've added is Hindi. So Hindi is available for automatic translation. That is why the auto translate button is coming over here. So if you add a language which is not supported in the list of the automatic translations from Shopify, then this button wouldn't be showing over here. So uh, Hindi, as we saw, is available there. So that is why this button is showing over there and we can click on auto translate and it will actually uh, translate automatically for us using the Google Translate. That's how it works. By the time we get the uh, Hindi contents, let us add another language uh, which is Arabic, uh, which is not there in the list uh, where we have to actually add the manual translations. So for that, what you have to do is you have to come on settings and click on languages and here you need to add a new language. Click on add language and add the new language Arabic over here and click on next so we are adding it to I am going to add it to uh, Saudi Arabia as well as UAE so now I have added Arabic and I'll click on publish Arabic language now if I come back to the translate and adapt app I can see that the three languages which I have added on the settings are now over here. So let us select Arabic. So they show they are telling us that Arabic is not available for automatic translations. So the auto translate button is not there. So in case of Arabic, what you should do is you need to 
use a uh, manual translations which is better in case of arabic so what you can do is you can go to uh, for example products if you want to edit uh, add the arabic translation to products you can click on the products uh, over here and then you will see on the uh, left hand side the list of all the products that you have and you can choose from here whichever products you want to add the translation to after you select the product uh, you can actually add the arabic uh, content for the uh, for the particular product over here uh, then whatever is the description you want to add whatever is the materials the care and all this meta these are all me metaphors that are coming from uh, my product so these things you can add uh, then the different option names the variants and the sizes everything all those data will be coming here and you can add and click on save so it will be uh, translated okay and that will be shown on your store now if i click on view store so you can see that the arabic uh, translations which i have added have come over here uh, for, so the meta fields that i add these all are coming over here okay so this is how you will have to add the uh, translation now let's see what has happened with our uh, hindi translation if any of it has got translated so now if you go to the product you can see that they are automatically translating the hindi contents over here in case of arabic we were adding them manually but in case of hindi which is already there in the list uh, of shopify's automatic translator languages you can see that these are automatically translated now now let us just click on uh, view store and see the product now you see a lot of things have been translated into hindi uh, for the automatic translations see you can see this is a, this is hindi and uh, all the products and the lang uh, all the sections and everything they have now translated into hindi for us so in the next video i will show you how you can actually add a language switcher uh, on the uh, website itself over here your users can select their uh, desired language uh, to use the website so if they want to choose hindi or arabic they can choose from there please subscribe to our channel and give a like if you like the video uh, for more informative contents like this thanks for watching